Let's head back to Berrien, Washington to the Classy Chassis Car Show. Fred Westwood, this is an absolutely gorgeous car. A 46 Ford, correct? Yes, that's right, yeah. And the color is just right on this. It is beautiful. How did you come about owning this car or building? What's, what's the history? Uh, I, the car was originally from Arizona, and I bought it a couple years ago and uh, went through it and redid things to kind of meet my taste. In fact, I'm still doing things to meet my taste because you, when you have a custom car, you never quit on them, you know. What's the running gear on it? It's got a, a big block Chevy with a 400 transmission and an eight inch rear end. Your background in cars, did this start uh, when you were in junior high school or what, what's the his, What's your personal history as far as the, the car scene? When I uh, was in the, in the 12th grade, my father gave me a, a wore out 51 Chevy and I rebuilt the motor and me and him together and then I got interested and I had um, uh, three hours a day in the 12th grade of auto, auto body repair and I was invited to go to the to go to the Ford um, uh, school in Detroit to, to be an auto auto body guy but I turned them down and I'm glad now because <laughs> that lead is not good for you you know <laughs> when you're driving around on a beautiful summer day like today in this car what's what's it feel like kind of spread the gospel on what having a car like this is like well um, I spend my winters in uh, Hammett California and uh, I had, at that time, I had a 34 Ford and this, and we went to a little show down at the high school for the high school kids, and it was in the evening. Well, my wife would never write in this unless the top's up because she didn't want to mess her hair up. So um, uh, we got ready to come home, and actually I had the top down, and I drive it all the time with the top down, but I had the top down, and she wanted to drive, so I said, fine, you can drive. Well, I, I left before she did, and all, all I seen was a, a red streak going down the road. We got home and I said, what in the hell's going on, Brittany? And she said, oh man, I love that car. She said, everybody was going. <laughs> so suddenly it didn't make any difference about her hair being messed up. Uh, well, it was at nighttime then, anyhow, she's ready to go to bed, you know, but, <laughs> but anyhow, she's, it's fun, you know. So do you think in a, a car show in 50 years, it's gonna be a bunch of uh, 2005 Hondas, or do you think there'll be a sprinkling of our cars through those shows? I think our cars will still be in the show, you know? I don't know why not. I mean, all Hondas look alike. Yeah. Yeah. Well, Fred, I'll check back with you in 50 years, and, and we'll see where we are yeah, at that time. I'll be up on the hill up there above Auburn. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we'll be at the big car show in the sky. Right. Thank you, Fred. Okay. Beautiful car. Okay, thank you very much.